Duncan, first hundred days and uh, tactics. Am yeah. I? So um, I mean, just building on what uh, what Robert said. I mean, while we've been sitting here, the Senate's confirmed Rex Tillerson. That's good news. It means that uh, a team will begin to take uh, shape at State Department. Ideally, we'll see the same thing going on at Commerce. Um, you know, we have a number of people in the administration in cabinet positions who are friends of Mexico, who have expressed, how they, they understand how important Mexico is. What I would really like to see is not what necessarily Mexico wants to see, which is they want to see this all to be resolved in 100 days. I think that's probably the, the worst idea because that will not be a good result for Mexico. We want to deliberate this. What I want to see in the first 100 days is actually what uh, President Trump promised on the campaign trail which was that he would ask the ITC to conduct a study of the pros and cons of NAFTA. Uh, I think we actually do need an impartial evaluation um, of what the United States gets and loses from the North American Free Trade Agreement. That would be a very welcome and worthwhile study so that we can base any decisions that we have to make in the future on facts, not on the opinions or on campaign promises. And that's, I think, something which we, we really need to remind the administration about.